This segment is sponsored by Matson Financial Services. When you're nearing retirement or already retired, there are a lot of things to think about. And there are a lot of tough questions to answer, like how much do I need saved? Well, today we're going to help answer those questions for you. Joining us to discuss are Gary Matson and Laurel Stewart. They are the father-daughter team at Matson Financial Services, a firm that's been helping people retire successfully here in West Michigan for decades. You can also catch them on their popular radio show, Money Mentors. Okay, so I have some of the most asked questions that Love folks th you know, have about their retirement, either entering in or maybe they're already there. So I'm going to pose them to you. Ready for hope, this? Hope we'll get them. Hope yeah, we'll get right. them right. Yeah, okay. yeah, hope you do. All right. First question, how much should someone save for their retirement? I'll take this one. Good. So <laughs> when it comes to it, we talk about what do you want to do with retirement? You know, what does your, your plan look like? Because we can't say exactly how much you'll need without knowing those dreams, goals, and desires. Mm. And so what we do off of that is base your critical income need on the amount of money that you need every month to pay your bills. And then we're going to invest towards the lifestyle. Mm. So when we deal with high inflation, when we deal with some really fun vacations or you know your big projects in your home, things like that, we have the lifestyle side too. So you build all of that yes. into the plan and then you, you sort of so get So there is idea. no one number that yeah. anybody needs. It's so individualized, but we help carve that out. Okay, next question. How do I make my money last through retirement? Yeah, this is the key and that's really important for us that we put a plan together that we're using real numbers and actually we, we go on a little more on the conservative side. Mm -hmm. We want to be a little more conservative on our projections of income, what we're going to do in taxes, we think they're going to go up, and we want to make sure that you can have that lifestyle and living expenses all the way through retirement. So we want to have that almost 100% guaranteed. Mm. Uh, we want to look at it from that point of view. Uh, okay, when should someone take their social security? Yes, so this one a lot of people think I'm going to wait, defer, defer till I'm 70, I get the highest payout, which might be best to have the optimized strategy. Mm -hmm. But we look at it also on an individual basis because we want to make sure that, you know, if we're looking at my mom and dad's situation, for example, we want to make sure that how he takes it, what will that do to my mom if she's left behind as the widow widower mm -hmm. situation? A lot of people don't think about what that benefit will look like. So we'll help you carve that out if you should take early, if you should have widow benefits, if you should you know, wait till full retirement age. And we layer that into an actual written income plan. Okay. We actually had a client come to us, came through the door for that very question. And she sat down and I said, Diane, you want to take Social Security right away? Her husband looked at her and he looked at me and he said, don't you want to ask her some questions? I said, sure. I said, Diane, how long have you been on oxygen? She said, two and a half years. 24 7? Yes. Do you have congenital heart disease? She looked at her husband like, I got her medicals. I recognized, because I had a sister in that same situation, mm -hmm. that she has water on the heart. She's not going to live past 83 to the 90s and those type of things. Yeah. So her goal is to get the most out of the system. You want to take it right now and enjoy mm -hmm. those dollars. Take stress off other things you want to do and enjoy the traveling that you want to do as a family. Very nice. Okay, next question, taxes. How much oh, yeah. am I going to pay in retirement? More. It's going to go up every year. Um, so right now we are in a good area with taxes for the next three years till the end of 2025. They're at a discount, but after that it's going to sunset. We're in the Trump administration, so after 2025, beginning of 2026, they're going to be new. And we know, you know, economists have projected too that they're just going up because we've added so much more money to our national debt. Mm -hmm. So let's take advantage of it now, looking at tax strategies, paying taxes on it now before these really go up. When can I retire? And, and this probably really means can I retire early, right? It can be both. It can be, can I, you know, we've had people plan on doing 67, 68 because their math worked that way and we come in and we say, no, you can go now. And other people say, I don't want to retire till I'm 70. I want to do some things and all that, but I don't need to work anymore. So it's a variety of different reasons people come to us, but they want to make sure their plan is working to pay the least amount of taxes, have the income they want, they'll never run out, and then be able to pass on assets to families, children, grandchildren. All right. Well, thank you to both of you for thank plopping you. down in the hot seat. Yeah. Takes courage. Okay, for you at home, let's get you started. If you are in or near retirement, the Matson team will sit down with you and customize an enhanced retirement plan. They're going to look at your investments, your income sources, taxes, and a whole lot more to get you that retirement that you deserve. The number to call, 800-536-8907. 800, -536 -8907. 800 536-8907. Thank you. Thank you, Catherine. Thank you for having us.